Hello, this is Photography Gamer. Welcome back to the channel. Today I am reviewing Doom for the PS4. Doom is a first person shooter developed by ID Software. The game begins in a research facility on Mars. Basically, a corporation is trying to siphon energy from hell due to an energy crisis on Earth. Blah blah blah. Basically, evil corporation, demons everywhere, shoot them all, etc, etc, etc. So the game has three main game modes. You have a single player campaign, an online multiplayer competitive mode, and also a level creation tool. The game world ranges from space age interiors to the surface of Mars, and later on in the game, you'll go take the fight into demon territory into hell. It's not really a game where the story is that important, and after the initial opening, it's easy to zone out and just go on a killing frenzy one level at a time. So what is the game like to play? The first thing you'll learn in Doom is if you stand still, you die. It's unlike most first person shooters in that respect, there's no cover shooting in this one. It's shoot, move, shoot, move, shoot, move, because your enemies are fast, they're aggressive and they're relentless in their pursuit of you. So it's a very fast paced and violent game with a tempo and a dynamism that I've rarely encountered in any game. It's incredibly exciting to play. The combat scenes are accompanied by electronic metal music and they're absolutely insane. Difficult and incredibly satisfying when you clear an area. You start off with a basic handgun, but in no time at all, you'll have shotguns, rifles, and other crazy powerful weapons to destroy all these demon hordes with. You can mod and customize weapons with secondary fire and other alternative functions, which is kind of cool. The gameplay cycle is a little bit of exploration, then you enter an area that you have to clear. It usually ends up being locked down until you kill all the demons, and you can only progress to the next area once the whole region is clear. Then the doors open and off you go. The enemies are varied and range from annoying little imps to absolute tanks that will really test your speed, agility and accuracy. And one of my favourite features is you can actually rip an enemy to pieces with melee attacks to get health or armor or whatever. Basically, once they start shining different colors, you can run up to them, click in the joystick, and it's like, bang, rips them open. Really disgusting, but great. Visually, Doom is an absolute treat to look at. Bearing in mind the speed at which this action takes place, the frame rate was impressive and the graphics were awesome and they were never affected. The use of the lighting and the colors really make all the environments feel unique and different. It's a fantastic game to look at and watch, whether it's you playing or if you're watching a friend play, it's, it's as interesting watching someone else play as it is playing yourself. It's smooth and it performs really well in almost all instances while I played it. The audio is excellent, in particular the soundtrack. It has heavy metal and electronic elements, the music really amps up when you have one of the lockdown moments and it really adds to the excitement and the adrenaline really does kick in when the music kicks in. The sound effects, the menu sounds, the ambience, I couldn't really fault any of them to be honest, they're all really sharp, all really good stuff. Okay, so what's good and what's bad? What's good? It's a genuinely exciting game to play. The combat is really fast, it's intense, and it's utter, utter madness. The game is very, very challenging and it will test your reflexes and shooting skills to the absolute limit when you play on extreme. The graphics are fantastic, as is the sound and the music. The level creator is great and you can try out lots of community maps so it adds a lot of replay value trying out all of the different creations out there. What's bad? The only bad point about this game is that there is no split screen mode, which I, I think that would have been so cool to have like a, even if it's just like a sort of combat version with bots or like a co-op campaign, that would have been so much fun, but unfortunately not this time. Okay, so what is the verdict? Doom is an amazing first person shooter. It ditches all the conventions other first person shooter games use and it just resorts back to a more simple formula. It's fast, it's frenetic, and it's a game I absolutely loved. Even when playing it on hard or extreme, which is really difficult, even then, it's still an enjoyable experience. You know, I'm not a huge first person shooter fan, and I never really played the original Dunes, but when I saw this out, I thought, oh, I'll give that a go. And I have to say, right from the off, I was just totally in love with the game. I just thought it was so exciting and exhilarating, and it's so different to anything else I've played in this genre. And I just think it's one of the best games you can get for, for the PS4. Absolutely fantastic game. 
So my score for Doom is 9 out of 10. It's a fantastically violent, chaotic game that I would recommend to anyone who enjoys good games. Okay, that was the review. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. This is Photography Gamer, signing off. Thank you.